like a crazy camber TDI. Clearly, we can't work out there. It's um downpouring, which is okay with me because I actually have these Wait, control arms. Did y'all watch this or no? Did y'all watch this? We extend for the tilted TDI. You see, for the camber numbers we want to achieve, these arms are just a little bit too short, so we're going to have to extend them. And there may be a little bit beat, but these are actually the original arms off the purple TDI that I had, which is, you know, sentimental to me. But I got the old bushes We're on here because of the shorts? They were, they, they were toasted. That's actually crazy, OSQ. Ones just right on the vice. Thank That's you, actually insane. Right Funny enough, the metal that we're going to be using to extend these arms is actually just some angle iron. So if I turn this arm over on its side, Hold on. you can see it's got this contour. This video might actually be fire. I've extended arms before and actually followed this and then built off some structure from there. But yeah, I want to extend these arms exactly one and a half inches, exactly like the other side. So I'm literally just going to... He's extending his control arm like this control that's insane put that there and extend it with the angle iron it's i think you have to do that on a jetta though these side pieces you might have and to do that a hole right about here exactly an inch and a half so it's like all measured out and stuff and equal and have some extended control arms which is so exciting if you look at these arms, we actually have only about an inch and a half to play with before these arms start to contour out. So my plan is to have an inch and a half on the material itself and then have two inches of extend out. So we have about three and a half inches of overall- Okay, okay, okay. What did he just say? What did he just say? Okay, nice welds, nice welds. Oh, that's sketchy as f That's fire, but that shit's sketchy. Okay, my how how long are you gonna show it off for? Wait, hold on. No cap chat. That's sketchy, bro. That is sketchy as f We're gonna be skating at I'm some never speeds, learning a weld. And this is gonna be static, so it's gonna be taking a beating. Probably a smart thing to put a little... little Extending fun. a spring bucket is crazy. That's what I'm saying. Down. I'm just going to put that right there. I don't think I've ever Try seen somebody do this. A little bit at the base. Everyone's going to be happy. Yo, I should low-key collab with this when I go up to Jersey, chat. His TDI looks good. No cap. Crazy, but... I got the holes drilled. The CDI does look good. And half longer, and they're gonna replace this rusty old. I don't know why all German engineering has to uh, ruin my day, but the sway bar. Max. In the way. Max. Oh, the bolts. Oh my god. This is not a meme. I literally have the jack up on a 22 mil, up on a 10 mil, up on an M10, triple square. Well, that is so. F oh my god, that's probably the smartest shit I've ever seen in my life. What the. F Bro, he's using a jack to twist. Bro, what? Nah, nah, that's actually genius. That's actually genius. Up on a 10 mil, up on a Wow, an I would have never done that. Square. Well, it never. worked. And I missed it, but it's okay, because it worked. Damn. This almost became a recovery mission, because I thought I grabbed a 10, but I grabbed a 9, and it rounded the, barely rounded the heads off, and I was really worried. Grab my 10, I saved the day. Okay. And I'm going to reuse the bolt. Yo. Yeah. Oh, perfect. Slide out. Honestly, at this point, I'm using the jack for everything. I'm not gonna use my. Yep. Yo, that's actually genius. This tie that is rod actually bolt genius. Is absolutely driving me crazy. I think I'm gonna have so to do that on the GTI. Put on the lower control arm, front mount. The bolt. bolts be f on the GTI. Right up. Look how good that looks. Oh, I'm so happy. Okay, this is the motivation I needed. Oh yeah. Mhm. Mm Just watch. Just watch this struggle. Oh, oh yeah, wait, GGs. Wait. Oh, yes. Remember, being a YouTuber is full of struggles and some some bummer moments. My friends all just texted me. They said they're going to get some some barbecue food. And I said, I can't go. I'm filming a YouTube video. And honestly, I'm happy with my decision. Felt Although that. I wish I was there. I know that this is going to be worth it in the end. Back. So if you have a goal to work towards, work towards it. Reach. Bro, preach. Not like he getting shit done though. Too warm. He getting shit done. Out. I'm in a good mood. We got that out. We got this disconnected. We got this disconnected. We got the shock removed. Only thing left to do is the lower control arms 
inner bolt, which is always seized. And now, barbecue food is crazy. I heard that. The wrench <laughs> is about to uh, show itself. So wish me luck. Because last time I did this, it took me five hours. So we'll either make or break it. Probably break it. Let's hope not. Oh, you hear the crunch? That is insane. That is the smartest shit I've seen oh, all day, bro. Might have stripped it. That is the smartest shit I've seen all day. All year so far. I wish I would have known about that. I'm I'm stealing that oh, trick. Good. I'm definitely I'm stealing that. 18 to a 20. And uh So what I did the other day was I sprayed all the bolts down with WD-40. All these came off. No, the f and wouldn't. this one last bolt, I left it to be the last one on the control arm because that bolt every single time gets seized. The nut comes off. But the inside by the threads, inside of the bushing, seized. So right now, Felt that. I'm going to jump underneath there. Hopefully get it out before daylight's over. Felt but, that. Uh, we got this. Bro, chat, I'm not going to lie. This has been me for the past, I don't know, 10 minutes. Bro, Volkswagen's suck, man. It is what it looks like. It is I, Alex Wittick, out here at 8.30 p.m. Smacking this bolt. Oh my god. I'm For not one bolt. Of the bolt when I move the control arm. For one bolt, bro, it'd be like that. Felt that. Ooh, it's seized inside of that bushing. When I get it out, somehow, some way, you guys are gonna see. Gotta cut PM. that mother. Three hours later, we are we are giving up on this for tonight. Gotta pack it up. You gotta Call cut it! Else. Just it cut it! Morning. Day two. We got the torch out here. It's 3 30. I gave up on this, but my buddy works <laughs> at Volkswagen. He drives the <laughs> van. You know what he said? I got two of those bolts on board. Uh, right. I'm chopping it out. I cut halfway through the bolt. Uh, Look at that. Look at that hack chop. Got a little more to go. Just a little bit. Oh my God. Look at me. I'm filthy. Oh. That, that bolt. And bolt. You can literally see the layer of Yo, salt. Yo, Hondas are the exact same, yeah, bro. The bolt was so seized. You can literally see the layer of crust just like crystallized around it. Damn. Oh, the parts, the parts. <laughs> well, huge shout out to Sean. If anyone needs the part number to that bolt, there it is. But Sean told the boys over at Volkswagen Danny that Duncan I needed got this a part. Car. He got it in the bag, and Sean drove it over to me. He does look kind of like Danny Put that Rustoleum rust reformer paint on there. Since I paint prepped it the other day by just hitting it with the wire wheel and just getting the heavy rust off, I said just go back over it with this, and it just eats away at any rust, adheres to it, and it gets rid of it. So yeah, if he had music in this video, it wouldn't be oh, that bad. Man. I'm not gonna lie. Threading it real quick. Like it's actually not bad. It's just, it's just a lot of uh. Oh, that looks awesome. It's just, it's just no music. So now I gotta pull this out and I'm gonna use the jack. Now that I got this all jacked up and I got the adjuster nuts all the way maxed out to the back. This lines up beautifully, but it's a little bit cocked. So I gotta go ahead and put on my new toe arms that I a made. A little bit, huh? Well, that you guys and I are about to make. Throw it on there, max it out, get that all to sit right, and then we'll throw the control arm on. Cause right now it's way too crooked. Box is opening themselves. Now this what is normal. FedEx package, we got a few things, normal size. Now inside of this huge box, we got these two hex tubes. That's it. It's out of the whole entire box. It's all lined up, ready to put the bolt in, but I'm waiting on the Volkswagen truck. Yes, I have the dealer delivering me parts. Name another oh, YouTuber. This lives in the f mountains, in the hills. What the? No, what is this crib like? Look at his neighbors. Who has the dealer delivering parts nah. to their house for their stance mobile? What? Yo! They're going to bring me control arm bolts, and then we'll have that all what? bolted up. Oh my God. Bro, bolts. look at this. Neighborhood. Wagon delivers to my house. To my house. Straight to my doorstep. Nah. Oh, yeah, that's the plug. Nah, that's the Hi, plug. Sean. Holy shit. He's the plug. Bye, Volkswagen. Sean leaves. I go to touch the camber arm, the, the box upper is control on fire. camber arm. Seized. Look at all that corrosion. Felt so, that. since the bolts are stuck, I was freaking out. But then I realized Sean didn't get out of work till five. So, I texted him the part number that I needed. Sean FaceTime me, show me these pictures of Love what you, I need Sean. exactly. And now he's going to drive back over here to deliver me the parts. So if that, you is, aren't yo, that is literally the same bolt for the um, for the cords, chat. It's the same shit. The cords do the same shit they 
fucking C's and then GG's, bro. You gotta cut them. So ass, bro. I'm not gonna lie. Off, no guarantees because I don't have a reciprocator saw right now. But that's okay. I don't know why they make their cars like that. Like C's. Big it's like J might all have a reciprocator saw in the truck. And if not, I'll run over to Harbor Freight and I'll grab a saw for like, what, 60 bucks or something like that. So run the likes up so I can pay for that stuff. Don't actually like I got the video. you, bro. Throw it a dislike. What did I tell you? Saw so doesn't work. Same so, for Acura. I'm robbing Nick's truck for this one. I don't one. know why they're like that. Well, man, they may as well steal this one as well. We're all in this together. Don't mind if I Not do. Not got two Jettas. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. got two Jettas. I just beat that. Full feet of half, baby. Oh, this is not that. white tape. Yo, all I know is this is like 6'6 six, six in person. He's actually tall as f Tools on the white interior is crazy. I didn't even peep that. Got Sean set up in the rocking chair. In here, we got the upper control arm, which is also known as the camber arm. And not only am I chopping it here so I can get access to the top of it where the bushing is at. Absolute nightmares are that being made right now. I'm huh? pretty sure that bushing is stuck in that little hole. And um, I'm chopping the camber arm so I can get farther up in there. Um, oh my thanks. God. Nothing special. You're filming? This is insane. Is this the bro who helped you with your first Honda? No, it's not. No. No, it's not. Oh, no, it's oh. not. Yo! Yeah. Ready for this, boys? Oh, this camber arm's about to snap right off. I'm snapping this camber arm right off. So it's gone. Ow! Ow! <laughs> bro, that got it. Yo, his... His crib gotta be fire. A whole foot taller than me? No, he's not a whole foot. Only a couple inches. I met him at me. He's my hey, shut up. Is that how your Type R sounds, no cap? Is that how your Type R sounds? Bro, Honda's, yo. I ain't gonna lie, Honda sound like... Ah. 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 Look at all those chickens. 9.30 at night. I prefer like a VQ over a Honda sound, I ain't gonna lie. I prefer, I prefer VQ over Honda, bro. I'm not gonna lie, chat. I should sound like a Hellcat. Shut up. Burning oh, me. No, it doesn't. Matter. Oh my god, this thing's on fire. Wait, that's a crazy take. Hold on. That is a crazy take. Wait, hold on. That's a crazy take. VQ, VQ over Honda. I feel like that's W take. VQ sound good. What? I can have it for so long that all the debris in there from the vibration just knocked. Like it a loose, 350Z. The rest of the bolt sounds the other great. Side. Guys, I don't know how to tell you this, but it's what Jay day was three, good. day four, but it's finally time to install the camber arms. I also have to note that there was three adjuster nuts. Now there's two. I took the last one out. Yes, bro. A 350 or a 370 with a flame tune? Yeah, that shit is fire. No cap. That shit is hard. Damn. I'm just getting started. All right, this is weird. Everything's this is weird. bolted up. And that shit felt out. like ASMR. I'm ready for the wheel to go back on. I don't know how I feel about this. I will not tolerate VQ kind of sound a slander. <laughs> now, VQ I wasn't able Wait, to actually the, the wheel because the control arm is actually pushed too far out and it is too cambered in, equaling out to my wheel hitting the filler neck. Now I'm just gonna pull that control arm. Relatable. The all the way out right now, and that's relatable. On the bottom, and then I'm gonna pull this camber bolt out, and I'm gonna put that nut back in, which should also give me a half inch back out, and we should be away from the filler neck. That filler neck, boys. Take that shit out. Negative 23? Negative 23? We're sitting on the fuel filler neck. Mark 5 Tay, where are you at? The wheel's actually only held on by- What the f Nah! <laughs> no, that's actually crazy. No, that's actually crazy though. That's actually crazy. By two lugs because I that's couldn't get crazy. the wheel to sit flat to bolt in the other wobble bolts. Because we're sitting on the field. That's wild. Neck. 
But now that I know I'm able to achieve negative 23, and I actually did not move the lower control arm, I, I love how much yo, the bottom of that wheel kicks out. You should have cut that shit out. enough room for me to bring this wheel out and hopefully not hit the fuel filler neck. So I'm going to go ahead and adjust the camber arm more. I brought it out almost a full another half inch. So let's say we adjusted the camber arm a full inch and didn't adjust the bottoms. That's how you properly adjust. I just add washers. That's a half W because he's going to make a bad decision. got a little decision. bit of toe in. So what I'm going to do for that is instead of adjusting the toe arm itself, yeah. I'm going to adjust the actual toe adjusting bolt that comes factory on this car, which oh. is then going to pull that lower control arm in a little bit from being two inches oh. to an inch and a half. And we're going to be even with the front as far as fitment goes. I don't even know how to do that. That shit never works for me. I think mine are seized. The wheel is still hitting the filler neck. Oh, I felt that, gang. I felt that, bro. I feel that, gang. Negative 17, Take that not shit on the off. filler neck. Cut it! Fender to Wait, lip. What? He got it to work? Negative 17, not on the filler neck. Fender to lip. I'm jealous. Oh, wait, no. Is he bagged? Wait, hold on. Is he bagged or is he static, chat? I, I don't remember if he went bagged or static on here. no way there's no way chat there's no way there's no f way he's driving like that there is no shot he hasn't always been static because so his last tdi was bag bro bro what nah nah no way there's there's no shot there's literally no shot he's riding like that there's no shot chat is no shot bro that is fender to lip that's bagged fitment bro there's no way that's rolling bro i fail to believe that shit rolls bro I ain't gonna lie. Get the bro, no fing shot, bro. If he gets that shit to roll, oh my god, bro. Nah, no cap. If he gets that shit to roll, bro, nah, I don't. I had to put a block underneath it because when I tried to pull the jack out, I couldn't even get it out. I put the side skirts on, and you guys are really going to get a feel for what we got going on now. Yeah. We got I wanna, negative yeah. 17 in the rear. We are not touching the filler neck, but we are fender to lip, which okay. leads me to my next conclusion. Okay. I think I'm going to have to start running a fuel cell. Just put it in the trunk, run the lines to the front. i already been done talks with what- What did I say, chat? Yo, it's literally impossible, bro. I don't even know how I made that shit happen for as long as I did, bro. I really don't know Park how. Five and No Struts, they both run fuel cells and they've been really killing it in know, the static bro. game and I think that's just the route I'm gonna have to go. This Mark V is is like literally, it's just getting started. I am, like look at it. How can I not be happy with this? You know what I'm saying? That like this, this is getting so crazy. Like Max. after all the stuff that happened in Tilted V1, you already knew that I wanted to go Tilted V2 again and just make it so much crazier. And this is only the start. Like we got body work to do. We might have to wrap it. We yeah. might go big twin turbos. Ooh. I'm speaking too much. But no, yeah. like this car is just, it's going to be what I want it to be. You know what I'm saying? Like, look it's at it. It's a gas, like, right? It's about to go so hard. Just imagine just pulling up to your local meet or just seeing it on camera. Like, it is the most beautiful thing I've probably ever created. I wanted okay. to tuck in the rear, but I mean, I don't know now. I was just talking about fuel cell, but I don't know. If I just run a little more, just a little more gap in the rear and run 50Ks, Fender to lip would be so insane. Then I wouldn't have to run a fuel cell. True. So I know what you guys have to say down below. So I'm like in a pickle right now. I'm like True, fender to lip as I'm looking at it. Uh, fender to lip static, you're going to have to be a little, bro. Bro, there's no way. Like he'd have to be like, it would look, we I don't even know how it would look, honestly. Them in Japan do that shit all the time. Though. Say down below. So I'm like in a pickle right now. I'm like fender to lip as I'm looking at it, both the wheels bolted up. They're bolted up. The car is being held up by itself. So if I was to run like that much more room, I'm on 50Ks. This thing is not moving. And if I make another two inch extension, Come I won't on, have to tuck in the front. Roll. So I'm in the dilemma right now. Tuck or no tuck? I th This is tuck. so crazy. Tuck. Look how crazy that lip looks like on the outside. 
just a little bit higher. It would not move. And if it smashed, I wouldn't even care. And it's like not even just the <gasps> wheel and the side skirts and all the fitment that's getting me hyped up. Like I'm just doing little things to the car, like the Audi R8 oil cap. If you guys want to pick up one of those, I'll have it linked below. Same with the black cap coolant ball. Like it's such a simple He model. does not have, have 15s in the, the trunk. I don't think bucks. so. Look how good the engine bay looks with the, oh my God. He could get less aggressive wheels, but those shits go hard on there. I'm not gonna lie. Guys, I gotta end this one off here. This is just, this is where we gotta end off. Fuel cell or no fuel cell? Are the you car excited? rolls like this? Let me know. Should I run the fuel cell and tuck, go another two inches, maybe even three inches lower? Or I should I go see fender to lip in the rear? Keep my out. OEM fuel tank, be a little bit higher off the ground. I'm in the dilemma. I need your help. You guys, you guys have been so supportive lately in the comments and just you've been leading me in the right direction. So I really appreciate it. So I hope you guys are excited for future content. We got lots to come. I'm excited for it. I hope you guys are excited for it. If you guys are hyped, yeah, you I didn't this say in the video, throw the video a like if you enjoyed. Subscribe. And um, I, I truly hope to see you guys in the next one. So I'll see w's. you guys there. Don't want to put you down. Bill's neat to you. And uh, we'll see you in the next w one. W Alex. A little bit of bonus footage. I had to throw you guys the hood down, the trunk down. And I just want to let you guys know, I really do appreciate how far we've come. I appreciate all okay, the likes, yeah. the love, the comments, yeah. the suggestions. And seeing all the comments of people telling me like, I've, my video's been taking them out of dark places. It's really been pushing me to get back on the platform. Yeah! Let me see how that looks now. Uh, it's like... Uh, I mean, it's close. It's close, but... I, it's close. I guess. I, I guess. I guess. I guess. I guess. He got it. He got it.